Where have you been? I said, the cemetery. He said, who's dead? I said, they all are. <laughs> I mean, what sort of a question was that? He said, there's been a fella knocking your door with a beard. I said, it's a wonder you could hear him. He said, didn't I see you standing in a field all on your own for six hours? I said, next door neighbor, you did. I was trying to get an OBE. He said, how do you mean? I said, I read in the newspaper. You get an OBE if you're outstanding in your field. <laughs> it was in the Liverpool Echo when I saw it, ladies and gentlemen. By sheer coincidence. You know, I read, he's a lovely chap this way, I, I read the Liverpool Echo the other night. Uh, you know the deaths column? And I couldn't believe the way everybody died in alphabetical order. <laughs> I mean, it is astonishing, isn't it? I'm going to go back a bit. One boiling hot, balmy, clammy, steamy, sweaty, palmy, roasty, toasty, simmering, sweltering, sizzling, scorching, scalding, blazing, blistering day in July. I tell a lie, it was raining. <laughs> and I was sitting in the doctor's waiting room. And a fly landed on my wrist and went to sleep. I thought, not on my watch. <laughs> and just then, this little man came into the doctor's waiting room like this. Straight into the doctor's and came out like this. I said, little man, but we didn't like that, come out like that, come here. What exactly did the doctor do? He said he gave me a bigger walking stick. <laughs> I went to see the doctor once. I said, doctor, once, come here. I think my eyesight's failing. He said, it's gone completely, this is the laundrette. <laughs> and doctor, doctor, there's more, close the door. I keep thinking I'm a famous rock and roll singer. He said, that'll be the day. I said, you see? <laughs> and doctor, there's twice as more. I've got a right toe on my left foot and a left toe on my right foot. He said, you've got myxomatosis. <laughs> what a knack this is. The doctor gets all the funny lines. Now, we've got to help each other out during this economic climate, haven't we, everybody? I mean, that's why places like this with John and, you know, communities. I mean, I'm cutting the cloth. Oh, I'm counting the pennies. So far this week, I've bought a watch on tick, a pair of glasses on spec. Are you ready for the third? A Peter Pan DVD on the Never Never. I love it.